M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So, we're on the Anytone 878 here. This is the APRS received version. It's going to show you how to change your DMR ID and call sign. So, you go menu, like so. Go down to settings. Go down to channel set. Then go down, keep going down to, where is it? Radio ID number 13, select, and you can now change, if you select my radio, you can now change this to your call sign. So go options, the first one is edit ID, and then you can delete here, and then type in the right one, 2341437 is mine, and then confirm, then go edit name it's taking it down automatically number two select then delete then we're going to put our call sign in so if you want to know if you're on a b one two three look up here where it's see it there it says a b at the moment in capitals so i'm going to put in m yeah it will move along automatically and then we want zero so the hash button here let's go back a bit make sure you can see that push it and the numbers appear here so we've got numbers showing so we're going to go zero then it with a line through it look It'll move along on its own, then push the hash key again, capitals, so we're going to go F, and it'll go along, X, it'll go along, B, confirm, and then save. Okay, that's in there. Now, the clever thing about um, the Anytone is you can actually add multiple call signs. So when you go back in, you'll have the option... Not sure if it will show it on this this one yet, but you're going to have the options the option to add to add an ID. Here it is here. Add radio ID. Select and look again. You can select the ID name and the name, and then you can add another one. And so you can have more than one user on the radio. So I hope this helps you set it up. Any tone um, eight seven eight. How to add your radio, your DMR ID, and multiple. DMR IDs. 7-3, all the best.